So here's here's the way that control was initially implemented over the people by these people that want to behavior modify, you know, Christians, Catholics, hardliners, not the good people. There's good people within Christianity, Christianity and Catholicism. But baseline behavior control, the New Testament, is complete bullshit. That's coming from God, 1x. I can show you the mark on my ribcage. That predates the Christianity story to, to the times of the Vikings, even beyond that. Uh, but the principle is the behavior modifiers basically wanted to get you to do what they want you to do, to believe what they want you to believe. And, and in order to initially implement that, they had to start in small steps. So they started by saying, it's bad to swear. You can notice in my videos, I don't refrain from using cuss words, uh, swearing, because there's no such thing. <laughs> These people, initially to form a control system, a way to control you, they knew they had to first get you to think things were bad, or that they weren't good, or that you shouldn't say this because it's going to offend people. But inherently, a word is just a word, and it only takes power when you place power there uh, and, and say, oh, this is horrible, don't do this, that's horrible and bad. And the way they did that was by getting you to believe the word fuck was bad to say, you don't say fuck. Even though fucking is having sex and it feels great and good, but it's bad to say, you shouldn't say it. And, and they slowly would get you to believe that's bad and when you accepted that was bad, then they'd move on to bigger and bigger and bigger things and continually put more and more limitations and restrictions on your life, your ability to have fun, the ability to freely think for yourself, and come to your own conclusions and be a leader, a trailblazer, a pioneer, not a follower that blatantly, aimlessly goes along with insanity, which if you look around Earth right now, you see blatantly aimless followers everywhere led, being led astray by their own foolishness. Think for yourself and you'll truly be free. Don't allow people to tell you what's wrong. Swear words are bad. No, swear words aren't bad. There's no such thing. There's, it's you, you saying that you think it's bad, so you shouldn't do it. That's, that's a baseline form of control. The only thing that's truly something that's unacceptable in this universe is violations of free will. You know, not allowing another to walk that path and, and to grow through their experience themselves and come to their own conclusions, trying to, to automatically constrain. Now, it's different with a, a, a parent and a child simply trying to teach that child to choose things which are conducive to, to remaining healthy and whole and pure in, in, in its inception as, as being able to live. But to, to try to indoctrinate into a set of restraints and constraints and controls is foolishness. Nothing is gained by, by limiting the human sphere. Everything is lost, actually. Um, so when, when, you, when you sit back and understand to separate yourself from all these prejudgments you allowed others to make for you and start to make the judgments for yourself. Uh, in a simple, start with the word fuck. Think of your experience of fucking. Pretty good. Synergistic energy exchange, otherwise known as sex, is an amazingly beautiful thing. It's the way we make life, and God made it pretty interesting how we make more of us. It's one of the most fun activities, unless you're a lunatic and, and, and into some sick shit. But principally, it's an experience you enjoy. So how is it a bad word? Uh, furthermore, as far as, as allowing, once you take that and let that be, then they'll continue to implement more authoritarian constraints and controls over your life and limit your experientiality because now you're always trying to please the sensors and, and, and worry about, uh, you know, having a good time. But ultimately, when, within that thought, you lose the good time itself. You are no longer one with the moment and, and freely expressing, expressing yourself. When you censor your expression, you're stifling your currency and limiting your ability to be strong and brave and free. Um, to be truly free, remove preconceived judgments and, and, and things that limit you ultimately in life. It's not, a, it's not a hard thing once you look at it to understand. And, and the faster that you come to the realization and make choices for yourself and think for yourself, and, and allow yourself to clearly articulate your expressionalism in a manner that's conducive to, you know, being whole and happy and, and enlightened. Saying a cuss word doesn't mean anything. And that's why God uses a lot of cuss words. I'm just trying to shock you from the, the hold people have over you. You're allowing people to take hold of you and struggle you in there and restrain you and constrict your freedom. 
Uh, and I, so I try to shake you from those foundations of control because you, you've allowed someone else to come in and fill your head full of shit. Free, wipe the cl slate clean and, and, and move freely because it's through that initial constraint that they can implement more controls over what you do, what you consider fun, uh, anything. I mean, even drugs and alcohol, people that choose to do that, most are shielding themselves from some past trauma that they didn't resolve properly. But it, it, even if not, even if they're just doing it just to do it, it's their free choice. And no one can stop someone from doing something until they come to the free will choice that they want to stop. They're going to continue. And most of it, like I said, requires counseling uh, for emotional pain and trauma that was never uh, properly resolved within them so it is what it is but free yourself from these types of constraints and controls on your life because they do nothing for you they don't protect you they they're doing more to hurt you than they're doing good to help you so free yourself immediately from these constraints don't allow people to constrain you like that allow yourself to be free free yourself from those constraints